Welcome to a special edition of the Broad Podcaster featuring me, Jennifer Fierro, right here in the Highland Lakes. I wanted to get everybody caught up on the results of the two athletes who were competing at the Class 3A and 4A state meets on Thursday. They are Gwen Burnett of Lano and Hudson Bennett of Burnett. Let's go ahead and start with Gwen Burnett. Ladies first, if you don't mind, Hudson. Gwen finished with the silver medal in the 300 meter hurdles, clocking 44.54 seconds. Last year, she finished fourth in the same event, clocking 44.50 seconds. So, congratulations to Gwen. Not only did she get a medal, but she also did so in grand style. Way to go, Gwen. Hudson Bennett came away with two medals, just like he did in 2021. And just like he did in 2021, he captured the gold medal once again in the 3,200 meters. He finished in 9 minutes, 22.86 seconds. Last year, he finished in 9 minutes and 33 seconds. That's an 11 seconds difference. He was faster in 2022, and that means that he set a new program record and a new personal best in that event. Hudson then returned to Mike Meyer Stadium on Thursday night to run the 1600 meters, and he improved there as well, finishing with the silver medal in 4 minutes, 19.83 seconds to get that silver medal. Last year, he won bronze in 4 minutes, 23.96 seconds. So, congratulations to Hudson. Way to go. Great job. Super proud for both of these athletes. Of course, on Friday, Diego Segovia, the Marble Falls senior pole vaulter, will be competing in the Class 5A state meet. That is slated for 1 p.m. As always, you can go to TexasChalkTalk.com to find the latest on these events. I have stories from Hudson and from Gwen already posted to the site. And if you don't mind, please like, subscribe, and share this channel. Help it grow. It would certainly mean a lot to me. This is Jennifer Fierro, your broad podcaster right here in the Highland Lakes. Thanks for tuning in.